Hi guys, how are you? Welcome to a very helpful home goods video. If you're new here, I've been doing shop with me and decorate with me videos all about home goods for literally years, like five to seven years, a long time. And today I was like, okay, I need to film a shop with me that is solely dedicated to what I buy here, what I look for at home goods first as opposed to other stores, what I generally skip here and why, um, and the best kind of home goods stores to look for because personally, I do not think they're all created equal. So I'm going to share a ton of tips and tricks along with what's new here and I really hope that you enjoy. Please like and subscribe if you do. I'd love to have you if you're new here and let's go shopping. Now before you even arrive at your home goods location, try and find one that's attached to a partner store. I have seen both TJ Maxx and Marshalls and these home goods are generally twice the size, twice the selection, twice the variety. Like you can't even compare these sister locations to standalone stores, honestly. You're gonna walk in and see a bunch of outdoor furniture. I live in Florida, so there's like twice the amount of outdoor furniture um, as I remember seeing in Michigan. I generally skip this stuff, you guys. I do think Think you can find comparable deals and sometimes even better deals online and also it's just so much of a hassle to get home they do offer home delivery i have not tried that if you have then you can let us know what you think about it in the comments but i would rather have this stuff arrive in the original packaging fully protected at my front door than have to deal with getting such significant heavy furniture home twenty five hundred dollars for this like that's a lot of money but it's really nice furniture i just think again online is ten times easier for this kind of stuff. Now the lamps are a section you are not going to want to miss. I really don't think there's any other store where they have such nice high quality lamps for such good prices and the price range here is anywhere from $20 to $200 with the vast majority in the $40 to $70 range and keep in mind that almost all of them are set so a lampshade with a lamp base every once in a while there is going to be a random lampshade but those are few and far between and a brand I love here is Tahari they have home stuff in pretty much every category but I always am looking for that brand $100 for this one super cool I love the light inside of the base they do have a lot of smaller ones for desks or smaller nightstands in the $19.99 range I also really appreciate how they are sorted by color and this is a section where instead of a dupe or a look for last I feel like you are actually getting the high-end high quality fancy brand for that affordable price so do not skip this section guys the last lamp I'll show you is a floor lamp this one is $99.99 so cute I love everything about this floor lamps are typically sort of like mixed in with the furniture and not in the lamp section now we are moving in to benches I totally recommend in the benches here first and foremost they're not too big so you can fit this in a lot of different size cars but these are in the one to two hundred dollar range and they have pretty much every style and color you can think of these are also typically dispersed throughout the store so you're gonna have to walk around um, to find and see all of the options 199 every time I go I see this and I want to buy it's so pretty I love the detail here's the last section of benches some smaller poofs for $59.99 um, and then the one below it is a storage bench for $149. So deals on deals, styles on styles. If you need a bench for the end of your bed or an entryway, I definitely would check your local home goods. We are moving into chairs and I have a lot to say about this category. So if you need a larger, like an oversized style chair, I generally would look online. I just think the prices online are generally a little bit better than you're going to find here. And also it's going to be shipped directly to your door. So it's just a lot easier in that aspect. Any furniture with a lot of fabric, I would look over very, very carefully. Sometimes it's perfect, but sometimes there are finger marks and dirt, snack crumbs, whatever it could 
could be from other shoppers. If it is a lot of woven detail though, it's generally pretty safe. Um, I love seeing this and the fabric is wrapped in plastic and there are some really, really cool counter and bar stools here, but I don't think I've ever seen any more than two or three of the same items. So if you need four or up, I would just look online. Um, if you need an individual chair, like just a single chair for a desk, I would look here, but if you need a set of two or more, there are a lot of deals online for sets of chairs. So something to keep in mind, but this is very cool, very unique, and a look for less of, I believe a restoration hardware chair that was 129. See, here's some more counter stools. There are three of the blue, but everything else, it's only one or two. And specialty furniture is one of the few categories that I do think is worth the hassle of getting it home somehow, whether it's with your own truck or through delivery, because these are items that you almost have to be lucky to run into. They're just so unique and hard to find online. So this arched bookcase, $4.99, but it's such nice quality in person. I love that. And then look at this cabinet. It's also $4.99, super unique, super cool. I love the distressed weathering feature. And then the green color is so pretty. It's not too vibrant these are items that are just so hard to find online it could be anthropology but who even knows and then the bookcases smaller bookcases here are generally a really good deal too this one's 199 on clearance it has um, a little drawer at the bottom in person it has a lot of detail and you can tell it's great quality Let's talk about rugs next. So some I will recommend to you and some I won't. I generally skip the full size rugs here. I just, I don't wanna sound like a broken record, but you can get these online for very comparable prices and it's just so much easier and less time to deal with to actually get it into your home. I do think the runners and smaller rugs here are such great deals. $24.99, $29.99, around that price range. And I have been seeing the Rifle Paper Co. rugs here lately, I cannot say no to these. I will show you which one I get when I do a haul at the end. These are my absolute favorites. I love that they are thin so they don't show wear, but they also have great structure to them. I really think all of the smaller rugs here are an area you don't want to miss. The prices are just that good. You see the runner at the top, the blue with the cream edge. I didn't even notice that in store. And then I saw the clip and I was like, oh, I should have checked that out. Here's some prices for you guys. These fit in any car, fit in a backpack sometimes. The thicker ones that are on the hooks, I generally skip these because they are for the most part too thick to put in front of a door. Um, but if you need a rug like in front of a kitchen sink, then you might want to consider some of these. Now let's talk about side tables and nightstands. Highly recommend these at Home Goods. I think the prices are very comparable to online, sometimes even better. And all of these are just so unique. It's not like your standard style. This one's great quality, 129, very heavy, solid wood. These are actually pretty substantial in person. I was very surprised to see they're only 129. And then there are a lot of open shelving options that are great for towels, for bathrooms. If you need a little extra bathroom storage, they're so many of these at all times. Some are in the front with the nightstands and some are in the back by the bathroom stuff. I will talk about that stuff even more in detail in a minute because I have some tips for that. 79 for this, the spindle legs, the gold, so, so cute. Wall art. I can buy pretty much anything online, but wall art, I feel like I need to see in person. Home Goods is my favorite place for wall art. They have canvas style. They have a traditional frame with a glass. So, so many different options photography and oil painting and I could just go on and on if you need wall art for any style home and you want a deal I would absolutely check here first
The sets in the wall art category are going to be the best deal, $39.99 for two of these framed prints in a glass frame with a nice wooden frame. I honestly would not expect to see one of these for $20, so that's why I tell you the sets are where it's at. And then if you need a nice frame for a print or a painting that you already have, go to the clearance section and see what they have. I've done this before. This is $49 for two fairly large wooden frames with a gold edge. I'm foregoing what's in it because um, I'm sharing a little bit of a hack here. But yes, if you need a nice frame, look in the clearance before you just look in the frame section. You might get a better deal. Full-size mirrors, I do walk right past these. Again, the hassle, but I absolutely pay attention to the smaller wall mirrors because the deals over here are so good such unique finds it reminds me of like the lamps like how i told you very very nice lamps for a look for less price without actually having to get the look for less that's how i feel about these wall mirrors 49 for this one tons of woven detail this one is 34.99 the gold edge if you have a little vanity that would be really cool and then the last one right here 39.99 for this it's pretty big and has a lot of detail so i was very impressed with that price Many of you already know what I'm going to say about the pillows, sheets, duvet covers, throw blankets, all of this stuff is such a win here, you guys. Almost all of my throw pillows are from Home Goods because I just don't think you can get the quality for the price pretty much anywhere else. That was a set of two for 40. The vast majority of the individual pillow prices I will go over in just a second because I wanted to first touch on the sheets and the price ranges here um, are pretty big. The most affordable I saw was $19.99 for a twin. I would say a lot of the queen and king are anywhere from 30 to $60 just depending then every once in a while they're gonna have that $100 option like this. So this is a king size duvet cover, it's white linen. It gives me those anthropology vibes I know a lot of you guys like and I just think that is super, super nice. This set is $60, it is, um, there's two shams, a comforter, and three throw pillows. So I think that's a pretty good deal. They do have some sets with sheets included as well. And then this is some of the bathroom storage I mentioned earlier. This is $60. A lot of the other ones, or I'm sorry, $70. A lot of the others are in the $19.99 to $39.99 range. If you are going to need like a little bookcase for a kid's room or you have a small apartment and you just need a mini bookcase, look in the bathroom storage section because you're going to save significantly significant amount of money and then for all of my girls who like a little cute tray for their kitchen soap like I do look over here first in the bathroom section before the kitchen section because they are cheaper and it's basically the same thing like nobody's gonna know that you got it over here $9.99 and $12.99 for this one with boho vibes And now for the throw blankets. I love this section seasonally because it's just such an easy and affordable way to add some new color to your home depending on winter, fall, summer, whatever it is. This one's a little pricier, but I thought it was very anthro vibes. $59.99. $60.99 I think is the vast majority of these throw blankets. Anywhere from $17 to $30. And then every once in a while they do have the extra fancy $60, $100 ones. But for the vast majority, they are very affordable. So many prints and colors to choose from. I just love this section. I did want to very quickly touch on the bathroom sets because this stuff is such good deals. $12.99, I would say, is on the higher end for a soap dispenser. A lot of them are like $7.99 and just really, really cool prints and textures to choose from over here. I also do think the vast majority are more affordable than pretty much any other store, so check here for that kind of stuff. And and outdoor throw pillows are a great dear a great deal here these are $29.99 for two I know that because I have those almost all of these are going to come in sets too so that's gonna save you a little bit of money
and here is a quick look at throw pillow prices. So $19.99, $29.99, $24.99 for almost all of them. Occasionally there will be a $16.99, which I will show you for the smaller lumbar style pillows, but the quality for the price guys, like I just can't compare it to any other store. One area I almost never spend a whole lot of time in is the dishes section. The vast majority of this stuff is like seasonal and specialty items, so very holiday. Um, I do love their trays though. If you need any trays, highly recommend Home Goods. You're gonna get a great deal. And then also the sets are the best deal for dishes. So this one that has the plates and two size bowls is $34.99. It's a 12 piece set. I do think pretty much all of the dishes are on the affordable end, but if you want like the absolute best deal get the sets and then the silverware there isn't going to be any super high-end silverware so anywhere from $29.99 to $49.99 for almost all of it and this is honestly where I get silverware so like once a year once every other year I tend to buy a new set because I just don't want to spend like $200 on a really nice set I'd rather get an affordable one at home goods and not feel like I need to be super careful with it We just have a few more categories to touch on, important things I don't want you guys to miss out on. And one of those is aesthetic organization. I do think Home Goods does like aesthetically pleasing, beautiful organization items so well. $14.99 for those canisters, $8.99 for this beautiful basket with the wooden handles. The only thing is of course quantities are limited so you might not find enough of one item that you need. But I honestly like seeing a bunch of different style organizers together, the baskets here you guys are so good for the price and then hangers I really wanted to touch on hangers and this is one of the first things I thought about when filming this style video is these are such a good deal ignore the brand they're pretty much all the same thing $9.99 for 25 and then in the pink section I did see a set of 30 for $12.99 so if you need to redo your closet and redo some organization check here for felt hangers you're gonna get an amazing price My ginger jar girlies, this clip is for you. Sadly, the ginger jar section was small today, but $29.99 for that jar, such a good price. $14.99 for this, the larger bowl was $29.99, so they might not have the largest selection of ginger jars, but the prices cannot be beat. And then I did want to touch on the faux flowers, silk flowers, the fake plants, all of that stuff. You're not going to get the most affordable price here as like at Dollar General or at home but the quality is really, really good. Anywhere from $15 all the way up to like $100 for the large arrangements and all of them are super nice quality, have really unique styles and holders. I love this one, the woven detail, really cute for spring and $19.99 is a great deal for that. And then the very last item before our haul are the notebooks and calendars. All of that stuff is such a good deal here and really unique finds too. So I just wanted to quickly show you guys what I grabbed. We're having a very dark and dreary day today. It doesn't look like it from the windows, but if this is too dark, apologies. So first thing I had to grab this rug, you guys. There's nothing like rifle paper co rugs, especially for the price. And I couldn't even tell exactly what the print was like, but I knew I was gonna love it. So it's all blue in the middle. Can you see the detail of the print? so beautiful and i love that these smaller ones it's all a rubber um type feel on the back so it's going to stay in place really well it's the same size as the one at the front door i'm going to put this at the back door though and see how it does over there since it's thinner i know it's not going to be an issue with the door so 
Love that. $24.99. I need to look up how much I spent on that one, but I know it definitely was not $24.99. And then I grabbed one of these for my office. I have been meaning to get something like this for a very long time. So it's just a dry erase schedule or calendar, um, whatever you want to call it. It was $19.99. And at first I was looking for a whole month spread, but they only had one option right now. I didn't really love it. Um, and I do like how large the spaces are for the days and how there's an extra spot I can write, like something that's upcoming. Now it's getting right, something that's upcoming for the next week. So super cute, especially for $20. Oops, okay, I almost dropped that. And then the last thing is just some pillows. Okay. This is my favorite, favorite kind of home goods pillow. So first and foremost, a ton of stuff going on here, a ton of detail, $29.99. I just want to make sure, yeah, $29.99. Um, I love the fringe around the edge. And then the stuffing in these, it holds its shape so well. Like, honestly, guys, this $30 pillow at so many other stores would be like $100. It's such a nice quality pillow. And two, I think I'm gonna use these down here on the couch. I'm gonna do um, a part two spring decorate with me, just like finalize everything for spring, add a lot more pink and green and fun colors and vibrancy. And that is everything, guys. Thank you so much for watching and spending the time with me. Please like and subscribe if you haven't yet. I also have recent videos linked down below, so check that description box, and I will see you right here in a few days in a brand new video. Bye.